just work shoes doing Hey everyone, I hope we are doing awesome. Welcome to another video. Today I am going to be talking through basically January New Year's resolutions, my opinion on what New Year's resolutions are and should be, and all things related to sort of 2021 and what's going to happen. And I'm doing this intro just before I do day one of a 30 day yoga challenge. One thing that I've decided throughout the course of 2021 is that I want to basically try lots of different types and styles of exercise to keep my mind simulated to keep basically enjoying the stuff that I'm doing and I'm gonna try and do a different type of exercise each month January it was starting off with a 30-day yoga challenge which is yoga with Adrienne it's Sunday the third I'm a day behind already but I'm gonna kick off with day one now I might do day two later today as well just so I'm back on real time and yeah, once I've done this yoga routine, I'm gonna sit down and have a chat about the new year, my resolutions, my goals, and all that good stuff. I'm also gonna do a review of the 30 day yoga challenge in a later video to talk about the progress I've made and how I found it. Everyone, welcome to Breath, your 30 day yoga journey. Okay squad, we're back. Oh my gosh, I don't actually think I can speak with this face mask on. My face is getting super tight. Um, I've just been in the shower. <laughs> Woo, put a face mask on and I know I said I was going to talk a little bit about New Year's, New Year's resolutions, all that jazz in this video. So it's not that I disagree with the New Year's resolutions. I just know personally that waking up on the 1st of January and deciding that I'm going to change a million things in my life and stick to it just doesn't work and isn't sustainable for me. And I think that that's brilliant if it works for you and if it does work for you and if you if you've stopped smoking if you've gone on a diet if you've started a workout regime if you've done whatever since the 1st of January then hats off to you and absolutely keep it up but I know for me I just this is a sustainability issue that lies underneath that and I just I know I know I know that I can't stick to it for me it's it's not about being up here or being down here it's about living my life somewhere in the middle and quite a lot of my issues in the past with my food and my mental health have stemmed from from being way too restrictive in certain areas of my life so that leads me on to this year I've decided to do it a little bit differently and not set myself anything major as a this is my resolution and this is what I'm gonna do in 2021 it's more a work in progress constantly always a work in progress there are certain things and I'm gonna go on to talk about those that I do want to work on during 21 and I am really really excited to work on those in 2021 but rather than saying right I'm gonna do dry January or I'm gonna stop this or I'm gonna only eat vegetables or I'm gonna do veganuary or whatever it is I've decided that that much more sort of progressive approach really works for me um, and we all need kickstarts yeah I'm starting my maximize your 2021 which is a one-week kickstart and um, this afternoon yeah um, I'm filming this on Sunday the 3rd of Jan and I'm really really excited to support people in kickstart in their 2021 and I believe that I can do that and I can help and support people do that but this massive massive overnight change and taking on way too many things at once I know personally just doesn't work for me and from experience with a lot of different people people in my family my friends I know that it doesn't work for quite a lot of other people as well so just to vocalize that to talk about it to say it's okay to not set yourself a million different um, New Year's resolutions and um, that you know that you're not going to be able to to stick to or follow through with that is absolutely okay to be a work in progress and to decide at the start of 
2021 that you do want to do a kickstart you do want to take part in some awesome things that are going on but you also do want to live your life as well is probably where we want to be at yeah definitely where we want to be at so with my 2021 what are the things that I'm focusing on first one that I'm focusing on is trying to get a consistent morning routine back in place and um, and this is going to be very much supported by the group of 35 of us that are all doing maximize your 21 together and um, and I'm going to be doing a video basically summarizing everything we did at maximize your 21 and I cannot flip and wait for it it's going to be incredible um so getting that consistent morning routine back in place I think I've noticed quite a lot that my productivity and my mental health towards my work just getting things done getting organized and everything has deteriorated since I've been less consistent with my morning routine so I know that that's something that I need to get back on top of so yeah morning routine is one second one is movement yeah and this year rather than there's so many different exercises I want to try so many different things I want to take part in and get involved in and all this stuff and like I said rather than going full speed ahead with absolutely every single one of those on January the 1st I've decided that I want to focus on a different type of exercise each month and really 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 look at my body listen to my body think about what that's doing with that type of exercise now something that's going to have to be a constant throughout me uh, throughout this whole time is running i need to get my running and um, built back up again it's been really difficult actually at the minute because the roads and stuff have been so icy i've not actually been able to get out for a run but i really need to that needs to be a constant throughout the whole period because i have actually signed up to do a big race in october but apart from that every month i want to focus on a different type of movement a different type of exercise and just see how my body responds to it so in january i've decided to do yoga as well as my running and i'm really really excited excited to do that I think it's going to be a good change it's going to be an interesting change and I am excited to basically throw myself into it and see how my body responds and what it's doing and if it enjoys it and how my flexibility and mobility strength improves with doing yoga so morning routines movement and then the last thing that I want to just start focusing on progressively throughout 2021 is just taking care of myself now, a lot of things can fall under that umbrella um i've got a face mask on skincare is something that i want to start taking a bit more seriously i've really been trying to look after my hair and do some different stuff and use some really nourishing products on my hair over the last couple of weeks fueling my body with the right foods again having some fresh juices and um, really making sure that i'm getting enough fruit and veg in all that stuff and um, as well as sleep and resting so just basically looking after myself as best I can and trying to build a bit of a routine for my skin, for my hair, for my body, for my mind, for resting, I think is another thing that's going to be a priority for me in 2021. So I hope this video gave you a little insight into my approach to the year and to why I don't think New Year's resolutions work, why I don't think you should take on too many things at once, focus on one thing at once, baby steps with it. When you form that new habit, guess what? You can focus on another thing and another thing and another Another thing and another thing and before you know it you'll be doing all those things that you set out to do on the 1st of January but you'll be doing them consistently and your body and your mind will enjoy doing them so yeah baby steps take it at your pace focus on progress 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 all the time it's not about making overnight changes it's about trusting the process and focusing on progress to becoming the best version of you that you can be thanks so much for watching this video please hit subscribe on this new channel if you enjoyed Enjoy these more sort of stripped back Joanna basically talking about what she believes in and what she's doing day to day. Keep smashing it and remember anything is possible if you just work. Bye!